Hey guys, Brit Queen here with a Lego idea set to review for you guys. This one is the Research Institute. It is set number 21110 with 165 pieces and it costs about $20. Clearly this is supposed to be the girl set, although I don't think it was really necessary to have a girl set. Um, this seems pointless to me, but I decided to get it anyway and just kind of uh, see what this is exactly about. So anyway, first, let's go ahead and build it. So first up for your minifigures in this set, here is the Chemist, which is the only semi-original figure in this set. However, LEGO has made a scientist before in the minifig series, and it looked better than this one, so not really impressed so far. Next up we have the Paleontologist, whose body is not original, and uh, makes her look a lot like a track coach rather than a Paleontologist, but at least she has a double-sided face, I guess. And last up, we have the, well, basically the flight attendant. Actually, it's supposed to be the astronomer, but really she looks like a flight attendant to me. So this is everything you get in the Research Institute set. And uh, I'm going to share my opinions on this set, guys. And I know that a lot of you are not going to agree with me, and that's fine, but I'm still going to share my opinions whether... Uh, some of you like it or not. Um, I'm not crazy about this set. I don't even like the idea behind it. I don't think it was necessary to make this set. But I went ahead and got it to review it anyway. Um, one of the things that I noticed when I was looking at the minifigures is about the chemist. Did anyone notice that the chemist has a scared face? Is I mean, what is the need for her to have a scared face unless she's not good at her job and she doesn't know what chemicals she's mixing? I mean, that's the only reason I can think of for her to have a scared face. So, uh, let's... I don't know why they did that. I have no idea. But anyway, I set that aside. Uh, the set itself, her part of the set is this little science set, basically. And you have a little place for her to have cups. I guess that's like a refrigerator, because that just looks like regular cups. Um, maybe it's supposed to be something else, but they're just regular clear cups anyway. Um, and then you have the two little drawers here, one with a couple of syringes, and the bottom drawer is empty. You have some other jars up here, and it's always nice when you get one of these uh, beakers. That's always nice. And she comes with a green one. So that's cool. You also get a brick separator in this set, which is kind of unusual for uh, such a small set. But anyway, uh, one of my favorite parts about this set is actually all the extra pieces you get. You get a ton for the size of the set. Um, all these are extra pieces right here. And then my favorite part actually is right here, this printed uh, chalkboard piece. That's pretty cool. And then there's a telescope with her. Um, and here's your astronomer, aka flight attendant. Um, I think if anything this would have made more sense with the paleontologist uh, because of the scarf. But this is our uh, flight attendant astronomer anyway. <laughs> and then let's go ahead and take a look at the T-Rex. With this I can see where they were going with it. I can clearly see what it's supposed to be. I think they could have done a much better job on it. Uh, it kind of looks a little goofy to me, especially the head. I just think they could have done a much better job designing the head, but this is our uh, skeleton of the T-Rex. And you have a little telescope here. They're looking at a bone. And I guess your track coach is going to be your paleontologist here, because that's what she looks like to me. She's got uh, the um, magnifying glass there so she can look closer at the bones. 
all in all, I mean, I'm just not impressed with this set. I think it's kind of, well, very basic. Uh, there's not a lot of great pieces here or anything like that. Uh, really, the only the only piece that I would get this for is this little chalkboard piece. Um, and that's not really a reason to get the set. <laughs> but so personally, I don't I don't think this set was even necessary to make. I get that they were trying to show women in different jobs, but I mean they do make women figures in other jobs. They they put women in the police sets. They like I said have made the female scientist in the minifigure series. Uh, they've done a lot of different stuff like that. They've had a woman train conductor before. So I just don't think this set was necessary. I think that um, there's a lot of women that over-exaggerate uh, the need for more female minifigures. Um, but that's just my personal opinion. I think that as long as there are a few, uh, that's all you need. Because mostly, boys are buying Legos, so it makes sense that most of the figures are men. But, I don't know, I guess that's just my logic. But anyway, uh, feel free to share your thoughts about this set in the comments below. I know a lot of you are not going to like this video because of my opinions, and that's fine. But uh, anyway, thanks for watching. Thanks for watching, guys. Click here to check out Benny's spaceship. And don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe.